morning class. Today's lesson for your education is based on texting 101. We'll start with smiling faces, colon, then end bracket. This means that basically I'm making a text made with gratifications. But let's just stick to some basics, okay? Meaning that I'm demonstrating the purpose of each mark demonstrated like really? Really? an exclamation. Always has an explanation to answer any questions raising. Used on so many occasions. A question mark means there is needed answer. Maybe it's best to answer quickly and not leave me hanging. Two ticks at the start and end of part of the conversation are quotations. Just repeat the exact words what somebody has previously stated. Barely use commas which can lead to reading and mistaken what I'm saying. They are meant to allow breathing breaks and to keep your sentence partially separated. At the end of a sentence, a brief moment we can say is when you find that period. Not the type that you think. See, now some of you smiled and even giggled, which is seemingly okay. So next, talk about hitting of laughter. This can be defined in different ways, either behind or in front of a sentence. Just maybe the perfect place, or as a simple reply, or until the very end of that part of the conversation. Observation. It's my personal explanation, so pay close attention because awareness is what I'm raising. LOL means laughing out loud unless you have depression disorder. Then it was either a fake or possibly just a half ass smile. LMAO. Similar. But now that acronym is starting to state that laugh my ass off, I'd be afraid of that. See how I just use quotations? Ignore the question mark because that answer I don't need. But if I use a phrase, there was probably a real smile indeed. Now, not necessarily any laughter. Not with depression has you in its grasp and it seems like you're squeezing extremely tight that you feel like you're suffocating and can barely breathe. It's sad you're really screaming. Probably don't even want to exist anymore. I'm sorry, we're we going off topic. We're on number three or number four. Oh yeah, number three about the laughing tree. This is what I adore. R-O-T-F-L, rolling on the floor, laughing. That means you actually may have let all that type of roar. I don't think I've ever seen or being rolling on the floor and I happen to be laughing to such an extreme. Well, maybe when I was four, before I learned how to hide my feelings and constantly cry behind those closed doors. Lying insane, I'm fine. So my problems don't be a burden of people who just ignore you and lie behind your back because of jealousies and hate they have against themselves, projecting their problems like they're yours to everyone else. Sorry, class, I need to maybe recompose, I suppose. But these were the basics, indications found in just about any text or letter that others may have wrote. So take notes, although what test is supposed to follow this? I guess since it's just a quick quiz, you got the gist of it, right? I think we can skip it, hell. Make it a short period. Make the best of it and enjoy your lives. And enjoy your extra long recess. Send me your text if you have any other questions about this lesson. I will try to reply as quick as I can. Class is now dismissed. Are you okay, Mr. Preacher? To you? To you? I'll say yeah. But the truth? But no. No. Three dots means it's either the end of it or it's meant to be continued. I can't help but resume. I should leave this room. I can see right through what I believe. The truth. I can feel the meaning through you. I can even relate too. I believe here is despair and hate created by the way that people treated you. They may be awake if I leave you here and not hold your hand. To say me too. I feel like the world is a fair and disgusting. How it's forced to be consumed. So I'll wait right here since I'm your reflection in the mirror. In the mirror. And I know. That you need me too, you need me too. Death is just the resistance of existence. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I do. I do.